This is Big Lake. It's it's a very popular uh, destination for summertime. There's there's a lot of people who live here now throughout the year, but a, I would venture to say about a quarter of our people are in and out of here in the summertime. They start coming before July 3rd. Our fireworks ceremony is July 3rd, which is over the lake. And then a lot of them stay for most of the rest of the summer. It's important that our sewer structure protect the area, the lake, the wildlife. And I think that we're doing a good job of that. We've got these grinder pumps that are very efficient, the E1 grinder pump. We protect this water by trying to make sure that none of our municipal sewage is ever gets to the lake. And the way we do that is to have dependable equipment all around the lake, along with operators that live here locally, so that we can respond in a rapid manner. Originally, we had centrifugal pumps that were on rail systems. Um, they're kind of problematic because as they sit there for years, those rails want to freeze up. And then when you have a problem, it's really difficult to remove them. So. We've gone now to the E1 pump, which doesn't have a rail system. If you have a problem with it that you can't get response to immediately, then you can pull the whole pump and have one back at the shop, bring it, drop it in, plug it in, and away it goes. So it's a lot easier to make sure that we can maintain continuous sewer service throughout the district. We have a, a collection system that's around the lake. Uh, we have a grinder pump. Uh, stations. Originally they were the outdated style pump and we uh, just started to replace them with the E1s which is a much better system. We do operations of both the collection systems and the treatment plant here. Um, I like, I like as far as E1 pumps, I like the fact that there, it's easy to train someone on as opposed to the older ones that you had all the controllers and everything up above and you had to teach them every piece of that controller. Whereas now, all I have to teach the young guys as they come in to begin with is how to swap the pump out, and get the customer back in service. Then the pump can go back to the plant and we can get to the actual repair whenever, whenever we can get to it. It doesn't have to be done that weekend, so it cuts overtime on our district and it makes it much more reliable. People are here on vacation. And the last thing anybody wants on a vacation is to be held up by an unreliable pump that the customer doesn't know anything about and is going to take us an exorbitant amount of time to, to swap out or repair in place, which involves pulling a sewer pump out onto somebody's front yard when they're out there wanting to vacation. This way we can pull the pump, take it directly to the truck, take it directly to the plant, grab another pump, come back out, put it in, and away this customer goes. It, the customer is completely satisfied because you didn't mess up their weekend at all. You just, you just gave them exactly what they wanted, service back. And that's the number one thing we look at is maintaining service for all these people. As far as a supplier, absolutely perfect in my book anytime we get a hold of them they get right back to us um, they can get a serviceman out here within a day or two and and with the being able to swap out the pump they can take the pump back with them to the shop and do the repairs that need to be done and and they have an excellent warranty on their product so if something goes wrong in that warranty pro process we're not having to uh, to put out any of the district's money to f to repair it you can service them better, they're just a better all-around uh, grinder pump. Yeah, I mean, we, they're a lot easier to change out. They last a lot longer, and I just like them a lot better. I'm really happy with this pump, and I don't say that about pumps ever because there always seems to be something that's wrong that causes a hang up that you have to then work on later. And we don't experience that with this pump because we don't have to work on it on site. We can take it back to the plant, get a new one, drop it in, and away it goes. That really sums it up.